Oh, hello. A change in our understanding of change. Matthew Contanetti is a resident fellow at the American Enterprise Institute. Paradigm shift is among the most overused phrases in journalism. Yet, the coronavirus pandemic may be one case where it applies. American society is familiar with a specific model of change operating with the existence perimeters of our liberal democratic institutions, mostly free market and society of expressive individualism. But the coronavirus doesn't just attack the immune system. Like the Civil War, Great Depression, and World War II, it has the potential to infect the foundation of free society. <laughs> State and local government are at moving are moving at a varying and sometimes contrary speeds to address a crisis of profound dimensions. That's my dog making all that noise. The global economy has entered the opening stages of recession that has the potential to become a depression. Already, large parts of America have shut down entirely. Americans have said goodbye to a society of frivolity and ceaselessness activity in a flash. And the federal government is taking steps more often seen during the wartime. Our I don't think the government's doing that. I don't know anything. Our collective notions of the possible have changed already. If the danger of the coronavirus poses both to individuals' health and to the public health capacity persists, we will be forced to revise our very conception of change. The paradigm will shift. Listen, why don't we just not pay for anything and then when we have to start paying for everything, we just start paying for everything. That's all. And that's my husband too. <laughs>